Question 16. A gas is contained in a cylinder by a movable piston. Okay, so you have a piston here that we're going to compress. Final and initial position. All right, so looking at this uh, final and initial position, it means that I am pushing or pulling the piston in this direction. Uh. So a good example that you can have in your house is the handheld pump they use to pump the balloon. Uh. Okay, anyway. Cylinder has a circular cross-section of diameter this much, okay? Pressure of the gas is 102 Pascal. And the piston is initially 30 cm from the base. Gas is heated, so you're adding energy to the gas, causing the pistons, piston to move up so that it is now 35 cm from the base. Okay, pressure remains constant. This is important because for you to use the equation to find how much work does the gas do when moving the piston, we are going to use the equation work done by the gas is P change in volume. But you can only use this when P is constant. So if you have done the gas chapter in A2, ideal gas chapter 10, I have pro I have actually explained in detail that work done is actually an integral. So for you to just multiply, you have to make sure your P is constant. But this is AS. So as long as your P is constant, we can use the equation already. All right. So W is equal to P change in volume. We know the pressure of gas 102 Pascal. Make sure everybody is SI. Lo. Change in volume is what? Well, let's look at this. Um, this is my change in length, and I need to multiply by the area. So I will take area, multiply by the change in length. Okay. So 102, what is our area? Pi r square, so 0 0.1 square. Okay. This is 0 0.2 meter, so r is 0 0.1 meter. Okay. Okay. So pi r square times change in length. What's our change in length? Uh? 5 cm. I'm just going to change it to meter, okay? 5 times 10 to the power of negative 2 meter. Why have to change to meter? So that your final answer can write joule. All right, so here will be times 5 cm change to meter, negative 2. Okay, then you can press your calculator. This is my delta L in meter and my area is in meter square. Pretty common question, uh, this one. So here I will get 0 0.160 joule. I think every year we'll have one guess question because they have to ask this because it's in the syllabus. But it's like a very odd child, doesn't belong anywhere. Poor thing. Okay, so work done is pressure multiplied by the change in volume. Just make sure everything here is SI, including pressure, which should be in Pascal. So I've converted all the centimeter to meter from the radius pi r square to the diameter, sorry, not, not to the diameter, to the change in length phi cm by adding a prefix of negative 2. Right, that's it for the question of heating up the gas and the piston move upwards. Gas expanding at constant pressure.